wish those who see Mr. Pidu be as an ethnic candidate can get to know him better. Hakim Baba Ahmed. Welcome to the news and please subscribe to our channel. Spokesperson of the Northern Elders Forum, NEF, Dr. Hakim Baba Ahmed, has thrown his weight behind the presidential candidate for the Labour Party, LP, Mr. B2B, after he revealed that he spent valuable time with him. Dr. Baba Ahmed, who made this known via his tweet on his official Twitter handle, expressed his wish that those who see Mr. P2B as a candidate for a particular ethnic group can get close to know him better. He tweet reads, I spent valuable time with Mr. P2B this morning. I wish those who see him as an ethnic candidate can know him better. I also wish that those who try to sell him would tone down his ethnic identity. I hope the nation will see the candidates up close. We could have a, rec a revolution, he said. Now, see, <clears throat> most Igbos are satanist. We value Peter B because of his profile. Maybe Igbos are Okrika sellers and they didn't know the worth of their son. Now, let me say this. Let me say this. It is becoming quite interesting that a lot of people are coming out to believe in the OB ticket. And I tell you, and I'm not missing what when I say these people that come out and believe in the OB ticket that is in his personality, in his way of doing things, they are more non evils It is the few evils that you see come out that play this. And let, let me tell us, we have to turn it down. We have to turn it down. Number one. I don't know about you, but it is clearly, it should be clearly seen these days that people who come out and talk about will be, huh, will not be brothers. So South Eastern, I should take a cue from this. Obi is not valid because it's from the South East. Don't make it a South East issue. Don't make it an Igbo issue. No, Obi is far, far, far high. He's so high. It's far away from that, from Rarangu. And I think it is time we put our sentiments to, aside and really, really work on curing Nigeria of its illness. The more we waste time, huh? the more Nigeria goes sleep away. Nigeria, the coma. If the more they stay for that coma, the more most of the organs they shut down in no good deal kill. It is time we put our sentiment aside. Hmm? While I'm going to say, okay, South Eastern should stop blowing the ethnic issue, the ethnic whistle, I mean. They should stop blowing the ethnic whistle and they should stop making it seem like their son is coming out and they're supporting their son because it's their son. This man's credentials, his resume speaks for him. You know when they say, oh, you are the, um, you are related to the CEO or the MD, but yet you go through the normal process and the interview and somebody catches your son name and say, ah, you're related to this person, you know. And then apart from the fact that he catches your son name that, ah, and he's able to confirm that, ah, this person is related to the CEO. Apart from, they can't tell you, they can't, your, your fellow interviewer can't say, forget the fact he's related. The guy is loaded. This guy is the kind of person we need here. That is it. The person merits it. We are not supposed to be looking at um, a, a tribe whenever we want to give positions. Even as positions are sensitive like this. Now, the way the person carry is the person loaded with the qualifications we want. It was left to me. I don't know a lot of people who are not voting for him, who are not voting for, they are not voting for him, they are not voting for him for tribe. They see the perfect sketch of the Nigeria they want in this man's eyes, in this man's hands. He is catching it. And the thing is, as he does catch her, he go feed drum. Though it is not going to be done magically, it is going to take time. But definitely, it is going to be done. Okay. You should also explain his popularity without his ethnicity connection. And let me see how it all started. Mr. No Ethnicity, Haba. Haba. 
What ethnicity did Igbo people bring in to request to become to quest to be president come twenty twenty three? Have other tribes not accused the Igbos of not supporting their brothers even in the just concluded PDP and APC presidential primary elections? I live in Lagos and see how the Yoruba people are back in Tinubu and they're not being accused of ethnicity in promoting Tinubu. Why do people become obsessed about anything that has to do with the Igbo? This is not the time to attack ourselves. You cannot keep attacking yourself and watch your children die. Neither can you keep attacking yourself and watch your house burn. It's just like your house is burning and you're arguing over what does not make sense. At that point, where you go live not make sense to you. You no go first of all, go see whether you go feel salvage, even if nobody that has, if not your little properties where you get. Hmm. Okay. Obedience should market obi competency, sincerity of purpose, and capability that is ethnic. Thank you. That is the take home in, in this. See, I've said it for every advice you throw at you people. I beg, make one of the take home, especially people that are obedient. If they come, say this thing and they overdo them. See, take it in. See, take it in good faith. It's not the time to come out and start crying over it. So be sincere. Shock them. They know you people as if they talk one, they go talk ten. You don't go talk in our own. But can you people shock them this time around? If they say now like this, now you go tell them it's okay, we don't hear. They say make them the one that say, ha ah, ah. Waiting these people see where they're quiet. I make I tell you now, people won't know they talk. Now then if they want to do something, people they fear pass. And then if they want to do something, then they succeed. Why? Nobody go know what's in their carry for mind. For mind. I don't talk I'm to you tomorrow. Now only other ethnic people where they support Atiku, you go come, they hear, they blab, or where they support Jagaban, go come, they blab. But you see these people, they know they talk. They know that they hardly talk. Southerners take a cue from this. They're only good at attacking anyone with contrary opinions. I see if Obi is an angel with magic hands. It is an ethnic issue. Majority of OB supporters are Igbos. You're perfectly wrong. You're wrong because I have seen a lot and we have heard a lot. And I tell you, now all I'm saying is they should turn it down and just pick advice. Any advice with the truth, they don't hear. Mm. Dr. Baba, Hakim Baba Ahmed. Are you, you are carrying things too far. Your fallout with President Mohamed Baru should not make you behave the way you're doing. Everybody knows that P2B is an Igbo presidential candidate, and you are telling us we need to know him more closely. If I may ask, we even appoint you, temporarily to be a spokesperson of the Northern Elders, which Northern Elders is visited by OB or even consulted by any of his representatives about his candidacy. What do you hope by achieving, to achieve by imposing yourself on P2B? He can only use you and dump you. What we are to be achievement as an Umbra governor? How do they freak Northern traders in Anicha? How many votes can you deliver to P2B in Kaduna State? I am strongly advising you to please change your tactics and restore this respect some of us have for you. There is room for you to mend fences with your Northern compatriots and get things to work in your favor. Hmm? This is the problem we have. It is time we look past this ethnic sentimental issue. If not, it is going to eat us all up like a like a wound. Okay, on this note, we have come to the end of the news. We say thank you for sending in to listen. Until I come here next time, enjoy.